everybody. Let me kind of back up. We've had to switch rooms. Oh my goodness, it's been an ordeal tonight to get uh, online. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. Um, we've got a really cool free giveaway tonight. Free light bulbs out of North Carolina is going to be giving away a uh, free light bulb. I've got a picture of it. Look. Can you see it? The glare. There we go. We're going to get a free LED bulb. Um, it's very easy. Um, there's two things that you have to do. One is, is show lots of love for the Cree bulb. The good folks of Cree giving us the free bulb. So tap your screens um, and then share. Now, if this is your first time on Periscope, I've been really encouraging people to get on Periscope. Uh, to share, you swipe uh, swipe right if you're on uh, the iPhone and swipe up if you're on an Android and you'll see a share button and you can either share with followers um, on Periscope or your Twitter account. So we would appreciate to share. So here are the rules to win the free light bulb. You have to tap the most hearts. So get your fingers tapping in to tap hearts. If this is your first time, just tap on your screen and you'll see little hearts flutter up on the right hand side and then, um, and then share it. We'll, make, we'll do a drawing in the morning, and I'll let you know via Twitter. So please make sure you have a Twitter account, and then we'll get your address. So we did this with Oko Cat Litter, and it was really fun, and um, the person really appreciated it. So thank you so much for being here. Once again, we're having a drawing for a free pre-light bulb. Now it's, now it's expanded. Um, it's a Generation 3.5. Uh, Cree light bulb and it have a 40 watt and a 60 watt and uh, the good folks at Cree will be sending you one and you know what's really cool about the, the free bulb is you know it should last well pretty much forever now that is a little bit of an exaggeration but uh, you'll probably move before your bulb runs out so um, for those of you who don't know me my name is Beth Bond I'm with Southeast Green and we um, have been going through my list of 100 tips to live greener and so in honor of this, we're actually going to be giving away free Cree light bulbs for uh, nine days. So pretty exciting. We're going to skip the weekend, but we'll be doing it weeknights for the next two nights. Um, and to start um, tonight, we've been, you'll see the pink highlighter on the sheet. Those are the ones we have been um, going through. Those are the ones we've gone through. Um, so tonight, since we're in honor of the light bulbs, we're going to do number 49, which is replace light bulbs with CFLs and LEDs. Now, uh, this uh, the conversation about LEDs versus um, CFLs, seven years ago when I started Southeast Green, which is the largest online news site for sustainable business and environmental policy news in the Southeast, we cover 13 states, and when we started, LEDs were way, they were just out of reach, incredibly out of reach. Um, in regards to price. but um, And CFLs, people were complaining, but people would go on and buy those. The advantage of an LED is it does not have mercury, which a CFL does. And the CFLs are safe, but you still need to recycle them. So if you don't have a place to recycle them, Home Depots and uh, Ikea's are recycling, and I think some Lowe's. So if you're, if you're using CFLs, make sure you recycle those bulbs. Don't, don't put them into your garbage. Um, but that's the great thing about LEDs is uh, no mercury. So, um, you know, just in case there's some type of a contamination. So, uh, I am a big proponent of replacing your bulbs, but I'm also a big proponent of not throwing away old bulbs, just waiting, for, you know, swapping them out as they go. Um, another thing that um, LEDs do really great over um, uh, CFLs is, is CFLs... Um, don't always work in all the fixtures and I was really having a hard time in my bathroom with my fixtures because I couldn't use CFLs so I was having to use incandescents and when LEDs really came on the market in a big way then I could use the LEDs and it's awesome because incandescent bulbs, there's a reason they use incandescent bulbs in the Easy Bake Ovens because they are hot and they actually bake the cake. And the great thing about the LEDs is, is they never get hot, and um, so you can touch them if you need to, but you don't need to. Um, I actually did an interview with one of the guys from Cree. Thank you for joining. Um, would anybody like to tell me where you're coming in from? Just just send a comment. If you, this is your first time on Periscope, you should see a little black box in the bottom where you can type something. If you click on that, then you can start. You should have an alphabet keypad come in. So, anyway. Um, 
back to the LED bulb story. So the uh, LED bulbs, um, I did the interview with the gentleman from Cree. Um, welcome, Reen. And what, we've, what we were discussing is, is, is like children will never know how to change a bulb until they're like in their 20s because, hey, Tony C. I hope that's my Tony C. How are you? It's good to see you here. Um, they will never... Uh, no, see mom and dad change a bulb because these bulbs are supposed to last for 25 years so it is very possible for children to basically get into their early adult lives and, and, and finally have to change a light bulb. It's pretty mind-blowing when you think about it. For those of you who are just joining and haven't uh, have just joined we're doing a free Cree uh, Gen 3.5 giveaway. Let me see if I can get the picture of the bulb up. To win you need to send a bunch of hearts and then share it with someone and we'll do the drawing so the replay viewers have an opportunity to win also and um, this is what you're gonna win a, a Cree light bulb isn't that pretty cool and that nice of them to do that so we're gonna be doing it for uh, nine months so anyway to recap um, make sure that as your your incandescent bulbs uh, burn out um, I would actually recommend just skipping the CFLs and going straight to LEDs they're, they're now very reasonable and, 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 and they think, well, you know, oh my gosh, it's 7 or $10 for an LED, um, but you're never going to have to change it again. I mean, you, people, you know, 25 years. So somebody do math. I'm from Alabama, so I'm not really good with math. But, um, you know, 25 years divided by $7 plus you're using so much less energy, right? And they do give um, the same amount of light and actually they are brighter even though they're matching a 40 watt or a 60 watt they're actually brighter and they do come in colors because that's a, uh, a lot of times the challenge is people don't like the colors so um, there's plenty of ways to see all the different colors if you go into your local uh, Home Depot or Lowe's or, or whatever you will see that there's all different kinds of light colors you can do plus some of the LEDs now change colors and you can change them on your phone which is pretty cool too so I hope you'll check out LEDs thanks to all the replay viewers replay, replay viewers you are eligible to win just share the hearts and um, share this out with either your Periscope followers or on Twitter and we will contact you in the morning for the winner about 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time via Twitter if you want a free ball. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this.